All right, so this is going to be a Costco sale and review of this Health uh, Health Aid kombucha. All right, this organic kombucha, pink lady apple, berry lemonade, and passion fruit tangerine. All right, price of this uh, normally thirteen seventy nine plus CRV. We paid thirty cents extra for CRV, uh, but it was three fifty off. So basically, what ten thirty? Um, yeah, about ten thirty, ten twenty nine plus the uh, CRV. All right, so this was purchased back on February 6th, and it's good until October 6th, 2024, so basically eight months. Okay, let's take a look. Variety Pack 6, all right. I've tried some of these before. I think Pink Lady Apple and probably Berry Lemonade, um, but yeah, uh, Costco is selling a different variety pack. So there are six 16 fluid ounce, 473 milliliter bottles. Net 96 fluid ounces, 2.8 liters, all right? Best enjoyed, refrigerated, do not shake. So this was refrigerated and um, it's been shaked because the box has been moved around, but there you go. Living probiotics, organic acids, natural antioxidants, and organic fruit juice. There's the UPC code, okay? Same stuff on the back, just different um, way the cardboard is secured. Nothing on the bottom except for UPC code. Okay, they put all the nutrition facts and everything on the top. So nutrition facts, there are three different ones. So here you can see 70 calories each. Okay, serving size, there's six servings, one bottle per serving. Okay, and each one, I think, let's see. Um, there's some carbs, 16 grams, 6%, 15 grams, 5%, 16 grams, 6%. So um, yeah, pretty much very close. The berry lemonade has a little bit less carbs. All right, the sugar, 16 grams, 14 grams, 15 grams. So pink apple, the pink lady apple has the most. Berry lemonade has the least. And then passion fruit is second, all right? And then added sugars, 12 grams, 13 grams, 12 grams. So um, the berry lemonade has a little bit extra sugar that's been added, 26%. And the others are 12 grams, 24%. Okay, everything else seems to be about the same. All right, there you go. Best enjoyed refrigerated, do not shake, contact the bubbly crew, there's their information. Got a QR code, follow your gut, scan the QR code, GMO, uh, vegan, gluten-free, and whatever the K means. I don't know, kosher? I don't know. Okay, pink lady apple. So ingredients are organic kombucha, apple juice concentrate, apple essence, uh, live active cultures, which is bacillus, uh, Coag coagulans mtcc 5856 i think they're all the same so i'm not going to read that again <laughs> berry lemonade organic kombucha berry uh blueberry puree red raspberry puree cold pressed lemon juice lemon extract live active cultures that same thing all right the bacillus thing all right and then the passion fruit tangerine has organic kombucha cold pressed passion fruit juice cold pressed tangerine juice cold pressed orange juice live active cultures and the same thing all right Organic kombucha is filtered water, acids from fermentation, acetic, lactic, gluconic, and tartaric acids, all right? Then there's cane sugar, live kombucha cultures, black tea, green tea, uh, carbonation, and certified organic with the um, asterisk. All right, let's go ahead and open this up. So there's the two sides. I'm just going to pull these two sides open. Jeez, the glue is strong. Okay. And then we have this tab, so we'll pull that. Here we go. There are the six bottles, okay? So you got one Pink Lady Apple. You got two of each, all right? These are labeled for individual resale. You can see they have the expiration date and everything on there. So if you own a shop, you can actually put these in your shop and sell them. There's the Berry Lemonade. Okay, again, labeled for individual resale, all right? Oh, they do have some little bit of extra stuff written on there. And then we have the uh, passion fruit tangerine. Okay. 10% juice. All right. Again, labeled for individual resale. Say hello to more feel good gut days. Every bottle of healthy kombucha combines thirst quenching organic juice with the living probiotics, uh, fermented tea for a bubbly treat that's also good for your gut. Your sips away from a healthier gut and a happier you. Okay. All right, so we got Pink Lady Apple, Berry Lemonade, and Passion Fruit Tangerine. So we'll try the apple one first, and let's give it a try. Okay, so it says not to shake. We're just going to open it up. All right, it comes in this brown bottle. Um, it, you can see, like, fog is coming. I'm going to pour it in this cup. 
just to see what the color looks like. Okay, it has this yellowish color. Oh, it definitely tastes fermented. <laughs> So strong. Okay. It has like a vinegary flavor. It's very strong. <laughs> Acidic vinegary. All right. Whew. We got the berry lemonade one. Let's open this up. Okay. Same thing. Look at that. They put it in these brown bottles to help keep the cultures alive, I guess. Okay, this one's a pinkish color. Let's give that a try. It's better. I don't know if it's just because my tongue's getting used to the fermented flavor. Let's try this one again. And then we got the passion fruit tangerine. Okay, so far, I forgot what that other kombucha I've had. <clears throat> it's like a mango one or something. That's my favorite. It actually tastes good. These actually taste like vinegary. All right, so this is passion fruit tangerine. Let's pour it. <coughs> oh, it went in the back of my throat. <laughs> okay. This one has a yellowish <clears throat> color. This one's better. Okay. For your health, I suppose, for the taste, I would say no. It has such a sour, like, vinegary uh, flavor. Okay. I guess after drinking it, you kind of get used to it. But yeah, it's not something I would drink and go, Mmm, this is delicious! It's like I would drink this and go, oh, why? Because it's healthy? Oh, okay. Okay. I can taste the flavors that they're, they're saying. But again, it has like a strong, like vinegary fermented flavor. So because of that, it makes it too strong. I'm going to say no. Um, I think the other brand that I liked is called Hum, H-U-M-M. Um, that one tastes better to me. I don't know if it's because they put in more sugar or what, if it's more juice and less, um, kombucha health or whatever. But, uh, to me, um, I drink the stuff because it tastes good, uh, and then health comes afterwards. So if it's healthy and tastes good, I'll be happy to eat it. If it's healthy and tastes disgusting, and the only reason I'm eating it is because of health, then unless I need it because I'm going to die if I don't take it or I'm going to get really sick if I don't eat it or drink it, then, yeah, it has to taste good. All right, so that's pretty much it. I mean, they're not terrible, but it's not something I'd be like, mm, I want to drink this today. It's like I have this in my fridge. I don't want to throw it away, so let me drink it. Um, but I don't know. Other people have different tastes. Some people like kombucha, the taste, so... Maybe you might like this more. Give it a try. But for me, I'm going to say no. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye. Okay, I'm going to let my brother try it. I bet you he's going to be like, oh, why? <laughs> so I'm just going to put a little bit. <laughs> Here. And also, what do you taste? <laughs> First it tasted citrusy, then it tasted really vinegary. <laughs> Vinegar. Can you tell what flavor, what fruit it is? No. Okay, I'll try this one. Raz? 
berry. Okay. It's a berry lemonade. The first one was an apple or something. Ah! <laughs> it says pink lady apple. This one's actually better than the rest, but at least to me. Yeah, okay. Is that passion fruit? Yeah, it's passion fruit tangerine. But the rest are like <laughs> way too vinegary. Yeah, I don't I really don't like the first one. Yeah. The last one's The okay. last one's okay. You don't really taste vinegar that much. But the other two, you can taste the yeah. taste, especially the first one. After. <laughs> All right, so that's good. pretty much it. Yeah, um, unless you're really doing this for some health reason, um, I don't know. If you like the taste of vinegar, then go for it. But that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. See you all in the next one. Bye.